Our story begins with an agonist, typically a ligand, traversing between cells and great distances to reach the binding site of the G protein coupled receptor, or GPCR, a molecular switch that triggers a relentless intracellular signal in cascades in response to its activation. Once the agonist binds to the receptor, GPCR undergoes a conformational change to its structural proteins that allows the association of G proteins exchanging a bound GDP to GTP, that is initially bounded to the alpha subunit of its heterotrimeric G protein along with beta and gamma subunits. The alpha subunit then dissociate from the other two subunits, sailing the turbulent seas of plasma membrane to reach another transmembrane enzyme called adenylate cyclase. From here on, adenylate cyclase will proceed to be stimulated and thus activated as its main functional role is to catalyze the conversion of adenosine triphosphate, or ATP, to cyclic adenosine monophosphate, or AMP, effectively removing two phosphate groups. Here we can see the adenylate cyclase making its way to rendezvous at the ATP bringing along with him a jacket to convert said ATP to CMP. CAMP serve as a secondary messenger to regulate many of the cell signaling transduction pathway that can produce distinct biological effects on the body. As secondary messenger, it drifts within the cytoplasm, in search of a certain protein to phosphorylase and that, is protein kinase A. While feeling satisfied, BKA whose component composed of two regulatory and catalytic subunits, is phosphorylated by the CAMP which causes two catalytic subunits to dissociate and proceed to enter the nucleus for further phosphorylation. In the nucleus, the catalytic subunits proceeds to attach onto the CAMP response element binding protein, or CREB, and activated by phosphorylation, having two phosphate groups tethered to CREB, the transcription factor CREB, binds to a promoter region known as CAMP response element, or CRE, that regulates the increase or decrease transcription of downstream genes from DNA to protein synthesis.